The much anticipated album launch for One Day Call held recently at the Mega Plaza, Victoria Island, Lagos. It took One Day Call about six years to drop an album. One Day Call stated that it was because everywhere he went, they requested for his album, and that was the brain behind the title of the album. It's like, One Day, what's going on? Like, you can't keep on doing singles. Like, we want your album. And, you know, and when you want something, you know, you, you must have it. And that's why I had to just name the album Wanted. Even my mom wanted it. My mom was like, when? You have been telling me, you have been telling me, you have been, Mike, when? And you know, when I when I put the picture up, she was, the first thing she did was, hallelujah. The album, which has 18 tracks, features Two-Face, a.k.a. Tubaba, in one of the tracks. And he worked with about eight producers. Everyone must have expected he worked with his ex-label boss, Don Jazzy, or any other of his ex-label mates. But here is what he had to say when the question was asked to that effect. People must grow. People must turn. You know, people must change. You know, basically that's how I see it. And I intend to do that with different production. You know, I don't want to be stereotyped. I don't want to be like, okay, if you know, I don't have John Jazzy, I can't do it. You know, and I don't want people to think like that. Everyone knows that he is yet to sign an artist into the Black Diamond record label. He did not forget to mention that he met Don Jazzy in 2006 and was signed into the record label in 2010. This simply means it took four years to officially be a member of then Mohit's record and how he misses Don Jazzy and others. He talked about his personal life like his kid, his complexion, his weight and relationship with Chudi K. It rounded off with interactions and Marion.